It's the most important thing to me in my videos, and it's the thing I choose first before I sit down to edit a video. I'm talking about audio and specifically music. For any of my subscribers or regular viewers, it might be already clear why I choose my music first, but if it's not clear, then this next section will probably help you understand why. So it's so important to choose the right music for your video. If you are telling a story, you need something that's gonna rise and fall and give you the right tone for your story. And if you are doing a talking to camera video, just like this one, then you need something that's gonna be, you know, it's gonna run all the way through. It's gonna give you a nice sound bed and it's not gonna be too distracting. So it's really important to have a wide variety of music to choose from. Now, another really important thing is not so much the music, but where you got that music from. If you just get your music from anywhere, you know, it could cause you some real problems when you actually eventually upload it to the internet. I can say this firsthand because the first video that I made, I lost a lot of revenue on it because I chose that music from the wrong place, but I'll talk a bit more about that in a second. But first, let's look at the importance of audio and music in your videos. I'm wearing headphones and speaking directly into this mic because I'm going to deliver a line, something that I've written, which is kind of cheesy, but also ambiguous. It could be happy, could be heartfelt, could be inspiring. And I'm gonna change the music on it to show you just how powerful that change can be. And a little quick voiceover tip. Uh, this is gonna have a bit more compression on it when I actually use it, but when you do a voiceover, get nice and close to the microphone like this. Okay, you ready? I don't think it matters how fast we move forward. Our past is always there, right behind us, making it clear we did the best we could. And our future, it's just ahead of us, ushering us forward, letting us know that the path is clear. Okay proper cheesy, uh, but I wrote it that way on purpose because I wanted uh, I wanted it to feel like it could be happy, could be sad, it could be inspiring, you know. So now we're gonna choose some music to use over the top of that line. So I'm here on Epidemic Sound. This is where I get all my music from. And I'm gonna sort of explore here. I'm looking for something quite sad, but maybe not super, super sad. So I'm gonna go here to genres. Uh, I've been looking in small emotions for this. So let's have a little look through these. Good, maybe a bit too rhythmic. I think I might have used this before. This is maybe a little bit too sad. I think this one here. We're gonna use, yeah, we're gonna use that one. Okay, so I'm just gonna download this one. What was it? Blue flares. Okay, I'm gonna download this, download full mix. That's a quick point actually, it's really good. You can download all stems, so that's all the different parts of the track that if you wanna you know, play with the mix yourself, or you can download the full mix. Now, okay, let's have a look at what that sounds like with the drone footage. I don't think it matters how fast we move forward. Our past is always there, right behind us, making it clear we did the best we could. And our future, it's just ahead of us, ushering us forward, letting us know that the path is clear. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna completely change the tone of my vocal take without changing the vocal take at all. So I found this artist, Cody Francis, he produces music which will work for exactly what I'm trying to describe. And this top track here, it's called Feel So Lucky. Um, sounds like this. No, but, it's so good but you can hear there's a vocal take in there. So we can't use that. You can just see here, this little icon means that there's a voice in it. Below that is the instrumental version of that track. So we're just gonna listen to this. So that's what we're gonna use. It will have more of an advert feel. It'll probably sound a little more inspiring. Anyway, here it is. I don't think it matters how fast we move forward. Our past is always there, right behind us, making it clear we did the best we could. And our future, it's just ahead of us, ushering us forward, letting us know that the path is clear. Now it always blows my mind at how much the music behind a vocal can make it sound like a completely different take, but it sounded more inspiring, it sounded more like a TV advert or something like that. Now I'm constantly changing out the tracks in my videos and that's why I'm using Epidemic Sound because there is a huge library of music. I think when you find a really decent sort of music library, it completely speeds up your, you know, your editing workflow. Now I've been a paid member of Epidemic Sound for well over a year. So when they reached out and said, do you want to do a video together? It was a no brainer. I already know it's good, so I have no issues recommending it to others. So more or less every single video on this channel has been created using their music library, which is a library of, I think, 35,000 tracks and 90,000 sound effects. And the way that it works, if you sign up to their personal plan using my link in the description, I think you get a month free and 
you are covered for YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitch, and podcasts. So you're, you're pretty well set. And I said at the beginning how um, I made a mistake way back before my YouTube channel was a YouTube channel. We're talking five or six years ago. I used someone else's song. It wasn't really going to be like a big video. I was just uploading something just for the hell of it. And I used a track from a documentary that I really liked. And then that video got now nearly 2 million views. But for a large proportion of that video's life, it was demonetized because obviously I had a copyright claim against it, which is fair. Now, I've since worked it out with the owner of that song and their distributor. It was quite complicated, but this is why you are better off using Epidemic Sound because you don't have to worry about any demonetization. You can just use their tracks and you don't have to worry about it. You just, you know, set it and leave it. So if you want access to some of the best music in the world for your videos, uh, you can use my link in the description. It will give you a free trial. And if you decide to you know, quit during the free trial, then all those videos that you've made in that time will still be covered. You won't have to, you won't be demonetized or anything like that. So you have nothing to lose and 35,000 tracks to gain. So hit the link in the description and make sure you send me whatever it is that you create using Epidemic Sound. You know, I'm always really interested to see the work that you create. And, you know, so send me a Instagram DM or mention me on Twitter, whatever it is, whatever is your preferred communication. I'd be really interested to see what you make. So I was going to end the video there, but if anybody wants to spend a little bit more time with me, I'm going to just explore Epidemic Sound, show you some of the tracks I've saved to my own playlist that I'm going to be using in future videos. Gives you a bit of a feel for what's on there. And also here's some, here's some really great music. Um, let's have a listen. What I tend to do is I tend to skip forward uh, to the beginning of the drop. gives you a sense of what's coming. If you don't know waveforms, uh, the, 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 the smaller the, the section, the quieter it is and the bigger it is. So if you can see on some tracks, you can hear the drops. This is a cool track. I used this recently. This is, um, this is Demented Senses by Ian Luxton. I used this on a video where I was riding my Super 73 through the woods. Kind of gave a real kind of like, you know, happy, you know, running kind of feel. We can do this is the kind of music I'd listen to just at home. Day. Haven't used it in video yet. Again, quite a positive running feel. I think I know how I'd use this. Probably another riding the bike through the woods uh, video. Too much energy for my channel, I think. It's a good tune, but... I love this. I can't wait to use this in something. I just love the way it walks, but it's kind of got a kind of sadder kind of feel to it that I haven't yet made a video that fits. What else we got? Oh yeah, I really like this. This is cool. Kind of feels tense, dangerous. I haven't, again, I haven't made any tense, dangerous videos yet, but you know, this is on the list for sure. What else we got? This is when the playlist takes that kind of turn into kind of 80s vibe. I love this kind of thing. This is Never Right Now by ELFL, the instrumental version. Really good for like adding, I love to juxtapose the vibe. So if I'm in the woods, nature stuff, I love to put this kind of music, this kind of electro uh, kind of pop just works so well for me. You know, I hope people get that. Yeah, I remember this. I've been trying to put this in a video for so long. I just think it's a little bit too much like a montage, like a boxing montage, something. I haven't managed to find find a way to put it in yet. Let's do a couple more and then we'll finish. Again, I haven't, never, haven't found a place to put this one in. Oh yeah, I really like this. There's a section of this track that I really love. It's called 1-800-DIRTY. So cool, but I haven't yet found a place for it. But those cuts, loads of places to cut your video in here. And what's nice is it looks like by the waveform that it's actually about to finish nicely. Yeah, you could just finish there and that's the end of that sort of, what's that? 30 second B-roll, something like that. Cool track.
Cool. So I think we'll finish it there. You know, I think you've understood how how I love to just explore Epidemic Sound just for the great tracks. And what's great is I can use these all in my videos. Uh, so that's why I love the platform. Hit the link in the description. Have an explore for yourself. You get a month's free trial and, you know, have some, have some fun. And like I said, send me a DM. Let me know what you make and I will see you in the next video. Enjoy your music. Is that...